Hi everyone, Nevada Nail Person. So today I'm going to be sharing the June Shimmer Me Box with you. These are four indie polishes that have been released the last two months. So I reviewed May and this is now June. So um, I came across this collection while of course perusing Instagram. So that's one of the photos I've captured. So every month there's three hosts and one guest and um, if anything I love neons. It's 111 degrees out and I love neons. I love bright colors, sizzling bright colors to help reflect the feel of hot Vegas. So um, yeah, so that's just a picture I thought I'd share and here's another one as well. And it looks like the host, this actual site that I found is from Native War Paints. So you would go on their site to pick up these polishes. So let me get into these polishes with you. So actually the name of this collection is uh, Totally 80s Neon, which is quite appropriate. So yeah, so I'm going to be sharing some wonderful bright polishes with you and these are all indie polishes. So don't know if they're still available, but I would check them out. They might still be. So, or maybe pick up July's box. I haven't seen it yet, but I'm sure it's going to be wonderful. So the first polish, as I've shown, is from Native War Paints. And that's the host site where you could pick up these collections. This is called Totally Bodacious and it's a pinky grape shade, very vibrant pink grape shade. Of course, it's neon with a blue shimmer. So there is the polish up close. And of course, I'll be providing swatches of me wearing it as well. So beautiful, bright, vibrant polish. When I had it under the UV light for the top coat, it was just sizzling. It's wonderful. So the formula was good. It was a little bit thick, but I just put a drop or two of um, thinner in and it was just perfectly fine. No issues. So that is totally bodacious. The next shade is this beautiful polish from Colors by LaRoe. And it is a beautiful, stunning grape shade with pink shimmer. I described it as fiery in my comments. So you could, I'm picking up the pink shimmer so I think you could see it. And you'll see it in my swatches as well. It was absolutely stunning in daylight. The formula was a little bit thick on this guy also, but not horrible. Again, just a drop or two of thinner, not nail polish remo remover, but actual thinner, and it was good to go. So, of course, no white coats needed with these, these particular neons. They're absolutely gorgeous. And of course, being the shimmery box, they all have this wonderful base of shimmer as well. So this is Colors by LaRoe. This is Future So Bright, Gotta Wear Shades. Beautiful polish. So the third polish in this uh, monthly box was Tux Polish and this is the final of the host polish and this is this bright chartreuse neon green with a gold like shimmer so absolutely stunning gorgeous polish I mean it's like a highlighter level fluorescent it's absolutely stunning and the formula was good on this. The only thing I didn't love, and I mentioned this in my other um, review, the, the well, the actual um, neck of the bottle is quite large. So if you did accidentally like tip it over, you'd have a big old mess on your hands. So this is called Beetlejuice, <laughs> quite appropriate. So I think that's pretty stunning. I love shades like this for the summer. And the final polish, which is the one I have on, is from the guest in the, this particular month. This is from Blush Lacquers, and this is called Living in a Material World. And it's this gorgeous, vibrant neon coral, which is absolutely stunning. So there it is on my hands, or my fingernails. 
in the bottle. Great formula. Loved it. Loved the application. Loved the color. Loved everything about it. So this is Blush Lacquer Living in a Material World. So that is it. If you have any questions, let me know. I'll leave the bubble here to subscribe and feature last month's uh, Shimmer Me box as well. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.